This is lesson 13 in our basic JavaScript section of Free Code Camp. This lesson is titled Create a Decimal Number with JavaScript. So we can store decimal numbers in variables too. Decimal numbers are sometimes referred to as floating point numbers or floats. Note, not all real numbers can accurately be represented in floating point. This can lead to rounding errors. Details here. All this is really uh, letting us know is just like sometimes we could get a result from dividing numbers that will give us an infinite decimal. An infinite decimal cannot be accurately represented since a computer does not have an infinite amount of room to represent that infinite decimal. So just keep that in mind and that's what this note's about. So instructions create a variable my decimal and give it a decimal value with a fractional part. Okay, so here they already created our decimal. They want us to create my decimal. And we are initializing and declaring it, so we do have to use the var. And then my decimal, we want to assign to it a fractional, so just a decimal number. We could do something like that, semicolon. And that should be good for this lesson. We're good.